So in the last video we talked about delivery at terminal, the idea being that the supplier or the seller delivers the goods at a port or terminal of destination and uh, well that's it. So in this case we're going to talk about DAP, delivery at place. So delivery at place means that the seller delivers the goods ready for unloading at a place of destination in the buyer's country or a named place. So the main difference between delivery at terminal and delivery at place is that, well, there is a terminal and there is a place. So in delivery at terminal, the seller delivers the goods and is responsible for unloading them. Unlike in delivery at place, which the seller simply delivers the goods at the agreed place and that's it. The buyer has to come there and unload the goods. So if you're going to use this term as a seller, then uh, the thing to pay attention to here will be things like delay or terminal charges because those are going to be incurred by you. As a buyer, if you're going to use this term, you have to ask yourself what kind of goods am I really purchasing and am I in a position to actually unload those goods without destroying anything? Okay, other than the fact that uh, it's going to cost you more since in this case the seller has to bring the goods at a place you agreed. The place has to be any other place other than the terminal. So that's it. That's, that's it with this video. If you have any question, of course, do let me know and uh, you can comment or you can inbox your question or you can, depending on where you're watching this video from. If you're watching it in YouTube, do make sure to subscribe to this channel and I'll see you in the next video.